guys, my luck here today. Sad news, if you guys heard, uh, Kobe Bryant has passed away, along with five other people, including uh, his daughter, 13-year-old Gigi Bryant. Uh, this is a very sad day for basketball fans. Uh, uh, just a sad day for all people because, especially, especially for me and all the Kobe fans, because if you guys haven't, like, noticed or anything or knew, uh, Kobe Bryant is my favorite player, if you guys haven't know. Uh, he always will be. Uh, you know, this guy, he means a lot to me. You know, he's one of the reasons why I play basketball. Uh, so on teams, I used to rock number eight because of him. We can even go into like a virtual standpoint, going into like video games. Like on the old 2Ks, I used to like purchase jerseys. Kobe Bryant, you know, it's very sad. His daughter also died. It's just, it's just, you know, it's just terrible. Terrible news, man. You know, we lost a legend. This is a the thing is, I had a good start to 2020 until now because I just hear this news. You know, Kobe Bryant is dead. Horrible start to 2020. Like, it's every year. We have to lose somebody very important. Like, 18, we had X. 19, Juice World, And then now Kobe. I, that's just something I don't get. But, you know, something we can't change. Uh, you know, it's just... Just horrible. Top five player, you know, all time. It's sad because we never really... Because he hasn't been inducted to the Hall of Fame yet. And that kind of makes me sad because he won't ever have, like, a a speech because he wasn't inducted before he died. And the thing is, what about Kobe? He was a very, very smart person. If you guys didn't know, he got he went straight to high school. From high school to the NBA. I'm sorry if I'm messing up, but he went straight from high school to the NBA. So that obviously means he didn't go to college, but I actually don't know if he went to college or not. He probably didn't, but... He was very smart, you know, without college, you know, whatever he said, you just shut up and listen. Like, he wouldn't just say anything. He would just sit there and listen. You know, anything he said was, you know, very, very, uh, very, you know, important. So, today we lost Kobe Bryant. Sad. But, you know... At the end of the day, you just have to move on. It's hard, obviously. But, you know, you have to move on. Life goes on. A few days, I'm thinking 100 subs. If we get 100 subs, do a little giveaway. But, yeah, Kobe Bryant, he means a lot to me. And that he's gone is a very, it's a very big shock to the world of basketball anything man it just it's just, it hurts but you know just the old saying wait the old saying is you know don't cry or don't be sad that it ended be happy that it like happened smile that because it happened so yeah that's what I have to say I can go on and on of what Kobe Bryant has meant to me, you know. I can go on and on. But, you know, I'm just going to leave it there. Uh, rest in peace, Kobe Bryant. Prayers to his family. Oh, my goodness. It's just crazy. Yeah. And I'm out.